Good morning, Claudia here with Smarter San Diego TV. You know there's been a lot of negativity on the news right now and we want to counteract that with some positivity, send out some good vibes. We're enjoying a beautiful day in La Jolla Cove and we're going to talk to some people about acts of kindness that have left an impact in their lives. And we are here with Michelle to tell us about one right now. Hi. Hi. There was a policeman that was well known in uh, Lancaster, Palmdale area. Last night I was actually driving here to San Diego and then I just see flashing lights. And I was like, oh no, here I go. <laughs> Pulls me over and he's like, hi, do you know why I pulled you over? I was like, yeah, I was on my phone. He's like, yeah, okay. Comes back and he's like, here you go. I'm not gonna give you a ticket. Enjoy your drive and have a great night. Just don't do it again. There are good cops sometimes. <laughs> My family actually runs a, a charity breakfast every year to raise money for hospice care. Uh, and this year was the ninth annual year and we raised in a four hour breakfast, we raised uh, $9,000. So that's something uh, that we take pretty pretty seriously, trying to raise money and all of uh, the siblings go back home to, to help out with the family doing that. The other day I was in a Starbucks coffee and someone just uh, behind me like uh, paid the coffee for another person. just. Uh, and I think it was really nice to him to just pay the coffee like this and yeah, it was really kind. So tell us about an act of kindness that has left a good impact in your life. Somebody was coming out of a bike rental shop, I think with a bike and lifting it and he swung it and hit the chick right in the face and like knocked her over but like everybody came out from all the different businesses to help her. Somebody got on the phone right away to 911. It's pretty awesome to see everybody come out of the businesses like that, like all simultaneously and help her out. During the holidays, my mom will always randomly buy someone's groceries that's in front of her. Yeah, so she does that around the holidays and I think it just proves that um, you can do anything for anyone, anytime. A friend of mine, we went out to eat and um, they completely messed up on our food order. They ended up comping the meal. There was a homeless lady with a chihuahua in her backpack and she was barefoot so I took her in at Goodwill and bought her some stuff. That's so sweet! <laughs> can I give you a hug? Yeah! Oh, that's beautiful! No problem! It was it, awesome! Yeah. She was really happy and then I left before she could thank me. We could tell that she was stressed out and we pretty much gave her the tip of the full amount even though they comped us and I think that's a huge thing that you know, it's all about how we choose to respond to situations. So Jonathan, tell me about something nice you did. So, I gave the hotel person a picture and then he smiled, so I, so I gave him another one. Oh, that's so sweet. What was it a picture of? Uh, the hotel. And has it left you wanting to pay it forward? Oh, of course. You gotta pay it forward. That's, um, try to pay it forward every day. Uh, it definitely makes me want to pay it, uh, pay it forward, give back a little bit, you know. They really showed me how I want to act to my kids one day. Yeah, it's a circle, like, when you do something good, something good will happen to you. And Absolutely, yeah, I will, I will look to reciprocate um, at some point, or indeed give the same opportunity, or better to my kid. That's how we work in this world, is just paying it all for and being kind to everybody. We're all the same people and all the same race, so, you know, it's pretty easy to get along with people if you, you know, just kind and respectful and mind your P's and Q's. And, it's all good. We all kind of just flow together. As you can see, there's plenty of kindness going around. We want to keep the positive vibes going. Follow us on Facebook and YouTube and... Stay classy, San Diego.